Hello, this is Lisa from Happy Stamp, and today we are going to be making this card. I've seen a lot of these um, going around, so I thought I'd give my spin on it. You lift these wings up, and then it just opens up just like that. Isn't that pretty? Pretty Mother's Day card. All right. All right, let's go ahead and get started. So for the Happy Mother's Day on the inside, I'm using a Mother's Flare. I'm using this Happy Mother's Day right here. For the Sending Wishes Your Way, I am using <clears throat> uh, Butterfly Basics. This is retiring, so if you want to get that, make sure you have that ordered by May 31st. That's when it will be going away. <clears throat> Here's my uh, ordering information and in case you'd like to order through me. I'd certainly appreciate it. All right. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> excuse me. The other thing that is retiring is the Wisteria Wonder card stock. Um, so if you like that card stock, also get that um, ordered soon because that will be going away as well. <clears throat> so this card stock is cut at five and a half by eight and a half and I'm scoring it at four and a quarter. All right. Fold this in half. Let's get our bone folder, get a good crease on there. All right. Next we are going to need a piece of the Delightful Daisy paper <clears throat> and it is cut at four by five and a quarter and then you're going to need two pieces that are half an inch by four. You need two of those, that's for the inside. So let's go ahead, we can get this, <clears throat> excuse me, goodness sakes. We can get this one put on the front here. And this just goes centered right in the front. All right, just like that. And then let's get our punching done here. You're going to take your classic label punch, which is this one right here. We are going to take the, so this would be the left hand side of your card. We're going to take that and we're going to insert it all the way as far as it will go and up to the edge of the white paper. Maybe just down an eighth of an inch. Punch. Move it down about a half of an inch and punch it again. And that's how you're going to get that slot in there for your dragonfly. All right. <clears throat> My goodness. Let me take a drink, maybe that will help. Goodness, okay. <clears throat> All right, so let's get our, let's get our stamping done so that it can dry. I'm taking my Miss Wisteria Wonder ink. Um, For the inside, I'm using this Happy Mother's Day. And we're going to put that on our block here. Make sure that that's as straight as you can get it. And we're going to put that over to the right hand side just a little bit because on the left hand side, we're going to put our butterfly. So it's going to go over here. Okay, good. And then 
we will take our sending wishes your way from the butterfly basics set that aside for a second sticking to my uh, mat because my mat is laminated <clears throat> so it's sticking to my mat and I have just a scrap piece of whisper white here and this piece is four by one and three quarters you just need it big enough to punch out your um, sentiment with this uh, I can't remember what the name of this is with this punch. I don't remember what the name is. All right, so set these aside for a second to let them dry. <clears throat> I'm going to take another scrap of um, Wisteria Wonder, bring in my big shot here. Lay this down. I need the detailed dragonfly thinlets. These are not um, going away. These are going to be in the <clears throat> new catalog. Run that through. I'm gonna need that. Whew, sorry about that. <laughs> um, okay. Let's get this out of here. Could use my detailed um, dye brush, but it is over yonder right at the moment. So we'll just try and get this out of here this way, unless I can't get it. couple of pieces on here that I need to get off. All right, good deal. <clears throat> All right, so we are going to take the inside of our card and I am going to adhere that to the inside because before we can do anything with the butterfly, that has to be on the inside. So, there we go with that. And while I'm on the inside, I might as well take these two pieces of uh, DSP here. And these are just going along the edge. And I think I actually got one wrong piece on here, but nobody will be able to tell. They're so small. Because they have two different backs. All right. Yep, I sure do. Oh well, okay. <clears throat> You're gonna take your butterfly and let get out a piece of scratch paper and I'm going to take my wink of Stella and I'm just going to give this a good coat of wink of Stella. Let's see, do I have any left in here? Yep, I do. Yep. 
And this is just going to give it a nice, a nice shimmer. Alrighty. I don't know if you can see that or not, but I can give it a nice shimmer. All right, so we will turn that over and I'm going to take a little bit of our Tombow here and that's just going to go right down the middle of the dragonfly. Don't put any on the wings because you want those to be able to lift up. <clears throat> and that's just going to go right in here. Just like that. And let's let that dry for a second. Put a block on it. I'm going to take this punch again, well, here, and cut out a piece of Wisteria Wonder. I'm also going to cut out our Sending Wishes Your Way. Get that centered in there. <clears throat> then I am going to take my white one and get my Wisteria Wonder ink out again. And I'm just, I just have a piece of a sponge here, and I know it's the wrong color, but <clears throat> that color had dried off and I couldn't find my um, Wisteria Wonder, so it was okay. And just give these guests a little flick along the edges, just to get a little something extra there. take our scissors and we're going to take this right here and cut it right down the middle. Flip this over, get a little more Tombow on here. Just going to put it down at the edge here. And these are going to go on the back side. of this little piece here, giving it just a little bit of a border. Okay. Just a little bit. And you can't even really tell that there's no border on the edges here. Okay, there we go. All right, now our butterfly, you just take your wings and just kind of gently bend them up here. And there you go. Isn't that pretty? All right, so we will take some dimensionals. <clears throat> just the regular size. I have some edges here that I will use. going to go right down here like that and last we are going to take some of our basic pearls this is still the old style packaging <clears throat> and I am just going to scatter some small and medium pearls just around I'm gonna put one right here and I'm just scattering them anywhere I'm that you want. Oops. <clears throat> Pearls for Mother's Day. 
So I have one, two, three, four, five, six. So I need one more <clears throat> to make it an uneven number. And I'll just put that one right here. All right, so that is it. Pretty simple, but yet very striking, I think. So there's this one that we just made, and here's the one that we that I had made earlier. Oh, I forgot to stamp the little butterfly in the inside. Let me do that real quick. <clears throat> so right up here, there's this little butterfly in the Butterfly Basics. real quick. And put that up towards the top on the inside. There we go. All right. Now this can go like this and there you have it. So pretty. All right, all supplies can be purchased through my online store at www.happystamp.stampinup.net. If you have any questions, I will be happy to answer them. Just leave me a comment below. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye.